What better way to bring in the Jurassic June 2022 than an old prehistoric toy, or at least a toy that seems a little prehistoric to our new age kids. <laughs> Toy and dinosaur fans, this of course is Jurassic June 2022 from my channel. This year I'm going to be doing things a little bit differently. I'm sharing some of the Jurassic June love here along with David Blucher over at Blucher's uh, Videos and Toys, so definitely check out his YouTube account. Now before we get in that review, if you haven't subscribed, be sure to subscribe now. Be sure to hit that bell for notifications so you'll be alerted from anything that comes from me to you. Be sure to like this video down below. It helps YouTube know that you like what I'm making and comment. I love commenting with you all and opening up that toy community. Now, let's take a look at these Burger King Kids Club 1993 Dino Crawlers. Now, this is a full set of Dino Crawlers. And I gotta tell you, the, the Burger King Kids Club stuff, like you could tell it's super 90s because of all the artwork, but you've got these really cool dinosaurs like this one almost looks like a almost like a brachiosaurus but with like some sort of like stems on its head you've got this one that almost feels a little bit like a cross between a a uh what's that a carnosaur and a stegosaurus with these spikes but you got this nice purple motif you got this one that has a fin almost like a dimetrodon with the yellow and the, the blue it's a lot of fun and each one comes with its own artwork. You've got this Triceratops looking one here. That's got probably one of the best pieces of art on there. And then this Pterodon with this really cool artwork on there as well. Now, these all originally came, there were only five in the series and they actually came in these bags. Now I've already snipped them because again, I actually did review it, but the footage didn't stick. So. We're gonna take a look at them again. Now, the bagging on this isn't gonna tell us a lot about these toys. We need to get them out and get to plan. So right out of the gate, these are the five and their little dino crawler obstacle courses. Now, they're bright, they're fun. You've got fun purples, oranges, and yellows, bluish greens, greens, and oranges. Fluorescent pink, purple, and yellow, I mean, green fluorescent red and blue and then of course a fluorescent almost like an orange with blue and red on it these things are bright and they reek of early 90s which i absolutely love they're kind of ridiculous in their design and they they fit the part they look phenomenal now one of these i had already opened up and we're going to take a look at this one here um one of the things i noticed with mine is i apparently had gotten some i think Maybe these had like water damage on it or something, but the cardboard itself, I mean, it's from 1993, so it's a little shot and beat up. But what you get is you get these pieces here. Now you get a backer that has that wonderful artwork on it. You get a type of track here that has this, you know, really cool design. And you get this piece up at the front that says Dino Crawlers. And these are supposed to fit one and two the other so we've got let's see if I can get it to work this time couldn't actually get it to work the first time <laughs> it looks like it's probably not gonna work this time either uh, so these actually snap kind of into place is a part of me that thinks that, that I should probably have this laminated so that way I can I can set them up and have a little bit more uh, uh, a little bit longer lasting display here all right, so we wind up our dino crawler and then let them go to town. Uh-oh. <laughs> oh, that's fun. I like it. I could imagine running this one over rocks and stuff. You know, it's you could tell it's a four-wheel drive because they actually have these, these kind of spiked wheels on it, which makes it a fun little wind-up toy. This is hilarious. I love it. Look at that, and it got one stem on the side for, of course, winding it up and letting it rip. <laughs> this is really cool. And of course, each one, here, let's take a look at this, this Carnosaurus. So it's got this 
nice kind of purple. It looks blue on the screen, but it's kind of a purple design with orange and yellow. Got those spiked wheels. And it can go. Then, of course, you got its artwork right here. That's pretty awesome. On the inside, the dino crawlers, four wheel drive, and then its driving pass is right here. That's a really nice, I mean, I dig the artwork. Uh, this one, I happen, I like this a lot. I love this color scheme. You would think the purple one's my favorite, but I really do like this color scheme. It's very Aztec inspired. Look at that, isn't that cool? Then of course you've got your tracks there, and then you've got a, a kind of an orange and purples looking color for its track. A lot of these pieces, the, the Aztec inspired art on it reminds me a lot of Pano paints on walls. So if you're not familiar with him, you should look him up on Instagram. It has kind of a Aztec uh, kind of modern vibe to it. Very cool looking stuff and it's track. It's a lot of fun. It's got the four wheel drive there, dino crawlers. <laughs> Let's see you go. Woo! No, don't stop on me. <laughs> Think. Okay, that'll work. <laughs> that one's giving me some grief. This one's a lot of fun, too. I love this design. I think that's super cool. Fun spikes on it. Let's see. So this one charge in the battle. Woo! There it goes. <laughs> oh, it got stuck. No! And then, of course, its artwork is right there. That's super cool. I dig that a lot. And the nice artwork. Of course, the Dino Crawler's there. Each one has its own kind of obstacle course. And then they'd also come with these, which was your uh, super official membership kit that was totally free you know i never got one of these i always i always wanted to get one i think it was one of those by the time that that these came out i might have been too old for it so wow it's cool this is definitely a, a bit of a blast from the past you know with with these 1993 was you know a fun year was starting to grow up and and you know didn't remember seeing these in store or at i should say in the restaurant at the time but it's got a really cool vibe. I've been waiting a whole year to open these up since I got them at the end of Jurassic June last year. So this has been a fun blast for me to get to open them up, check them out, and to share it with you. I hope you all enjoyed this as well. Now I got this on eBay and I got it a long time ago and I got a pretty good deal from what I remember. So you're not going to really find them out there on Amazon or on, on toy shelves. This is really going to be one of those vintage things you have to get from a shop, resale shop, a convention, or eBay itself. So if you're going out looking for these, good luck with the toy hunt. This episode of Tay Ray Gun was sponsored by Marvin Dog Media. To learn more about Marvin Dog Media, visit www.marvindogmedia.com. If you like the video, be sure to hit that like button. Go ahead and subscribe to the channel. Comment down below to let YouTube know that you like what I'm making. And be sure to hit that bell notification so you get updates to future content.